okay good morning everyone and uh, today we are going to look at uh, PE that is uh, how to calculate uh, your PE the PE on your pay you need to know how to calculate it you need to know how they arrive at the, that figure so let's just go straight to the example I have on my screen here okay this is uh, what we are going to just play with and uh, let's assume this is your uh, payment on your appointment data so with these figures pension how do you calculate your national housing funds to arrive at your relief how do you arrive at your pay finally and uh, the most important thing is how do you arrive at your net pay which is your bank payments the money you receive at the end of the month how do you arrive at that so we are going to just play with these figures and get all these things okay let's just go straight so now let's assume this is your annual and monthly payment so when you come here this this is your gross the summation of all this you have your gross uh, so based on this uh, example we have 8.6 as our gross and we have 723 as our gross on monthly basis then the 8.6 is our annual gross so now from this our annual gross we know on monthly basis we pay pension and we also pay national housing funds so this basic what is that oh sorry national housing funds what is it so national housing funds is two percent two point five percent of what of our basic only that is our national housing fund is two percent of our basic so you see it here it's eighty seven thousand five hundred which is this we have this once you just multiply your basic times two point five percent you arrive at it then we have our pension pension how do you are how do you calculate pension pension there are three three elements that you are going to look at first is your basic salary then your housing allowance your transport allowance you first have to add these three things once you add these three things based on this example we have 6.2 million naira. then your basic is the percentage of your contribution as basic is eight percent so you now calculate eight percent of that once you do it you see that you have a uh, 496,000 naira. that is what you have as your pension there is employers contribution so employers contribution we are not going to consider it here because we want to calculate your tax so we are not going to consider that one is sort of less important to us now so these two payments they are statutory payments so to arrive at our chargeable income we need to remove them from our gross so we are getting there then the total of these two things uh, is 583 500 which is this so now our consolidated gross we have uh, we now have to remove this 853 from this our gross which is 8.6 so once you do that you will see that you have 1.8.1 8.1 million naira. that is what we have now the next thing is to calculate our relief government now said okay i'm going to give you relief 
that relief is what we are going to remove from our gross we will remove it so that it will not be part of our tax we are not going to calculate tax on it so there are two types of reliefs here one there is 20 percent of your gross secondly we have two hundred thousand so that two hundred thousand is constant it's just fixed there there is no percentage attached to it it's just two hundred thousand naira. so you just remove your 200 from there that is why we have this 200 here then this 20 percent you now calculate 20 percent of this 8.1 20 percent of 8.1 is 1.6 we have 1.6 so that is what we have then the total of these two we have what we have 1.8 it's one million eight hundred and twenty three hundred thousand three hundred naira so that is what we have as our total relief then we can now come down we know we have already calculated our statutory payment that is nhf and pension so now to arrive at our chargeable income how do we do that we are going to re remove this our total relief and our statutory payment that is from this 8.6 we are going to remove what we are going to remove this total relief which is 1.8 we are going to remove our statutory payment which is 583 500 so what do we have we have 6 million 200 so we have that so this is our chargeable income this is now where we are now going to apply our tax rate on it now we are done with all the deductions what we are left with now is just 2.6.2 .2. on this 6.2 that is what we are now going to apply the percentage to arrive at our tax so to arrive at this our tax there is rates approved by the government you need to know this rate first this is it this is the table here we have here we have this table here so this table let me explain what this table means we have first 300 the first 300 what percentage are we going to apply on it is seven percent which is this the next 300 we are going to apply 11 percent then next 500 we are going to apply 15 percent that is the first 500 we apply 15 percent on it then the next 500 we are going to apply 19 percent then we have 1.6 we are going to apply 21 percent on it then we have 24 percent so the remaining balance we are going to apply 24 percent when you add this everything is to 3.2 we have 3.2 million naira there so whatever balance you have you are expected to apply 24 percent on it so let's go back to this our example so based on this our example we have 6.2 million naira that is 6 million 281 200 that is our chargeable income so when you look at it here our first 300 okay let's say 300 times seven percent we have what twenty one thousand which is this we have this twenty one thousand here then our next three hundred we are going to apply eleven percent on it you see we have twenty thirty three thousand naira have thirty three thousand naira then the first five hundred we are going to apply what 
we are going to apply 15 percent now say 500 multiplied by 15 percent we have 75,000 you see it here then the next 500 that is the second 500 we are going to apply what we are going to apply 19 percent so we are going to apply 19 percent to it you see we have 95,000 naira then what next then 1.6 we are going to apply 21 percent you see we have 336 so the remaining balance what we have here everything we have 3.2 but our chargeable income is 6.2 okay let's remove this we have this balance which is three million eight one thousand two hundred so on this we are now going to apply the 24 percent you see we have seven hundred and thirty nine thousand four eight eight that is what we have so you now sum all this now add everything here what do we have here we have one point to one million two hundred and ninety nine thousand four hundred and eighty eight so this figure is our annual tax this is what we have expected to pay every month every year sorry to the government as our tax so now to know your monthly tax now say this figure this 1.2 divided by 12 okay this is uh, your monthly tax which is uh, 182,299.67 cobble which is this so from there you now need to know your net p your net p is gross which is this eight million six hundred and eighty five naira that is uh, your gross that is the gross you have there then it's you now come and look at uh, your pension pension is not coming to you so you have to remove it to arrive at that then you will now remove your tax too so once you do this you are now going to arrive at your net p then the net p this your net p which is six million eight hundred and two twelve naira is your annual net p so you need to know your monthly net p just say this figure divided by